Hi everyone, a very warm welcome to the session. How are you all doing? So today we are going to have a very very interesting session, guys, with many quiz questions, and along with many, of course, we will practice. Uh, the other subjective questions from glimpses of india so this is going to be a super super interesting question uh, session for all of you so let me see your excitement guys how are you all doing are you super excited to have this super amazing session and a very very important session only and only for you guys you can see the link please join the link using three uh, please join the menti using the code 332161 Three nine. Hi, brave insider. Hi, Jia. Hi, Tanish. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the session, guys. And please quickly join. Yes, Natraj. I remember. I remember. <laughs> Definitely, I do remember. Okay, so we have the first menti question. Uh, first menti quiz for all of you. Write here on your screen. and please read the extract till the others join the menti guys those of you who have joined please read the extract because the question will start from uh, the question that we will have right now uh, the menti questions they are going to be from this particular extract this is an extract from can you tell me from which part of glimpses of india is this extract being taken Yes, Aryan Natraj. Hi, Mai. Hello, Sombir. Aryan. Ananya. Soham. Baker from Goa. Exactly. Very good job. Very good job. So, guys, can we have some likes? Can we have your love in the form of like buttons? Please show some love, guys. Please hit the like button. We have two menti uh, quiz, guys. Two menti quiz. This is the first one. we will have another menti after we do the subjective questions we will have another menti so it's a mix of it's an amalgamation of both menti as well as subjective questions because term 2 guys you're going to have subjective so you have to practice subjective questions right beta on abhi tak offline online now till now we know that exams are going to be on offline no notification of online exam has still come to us okay can we start guys have you all joined can we start with the very first menti question yes bhimeshwari ananya sarita okay since most of you are saying ma'am please start here we go with the first question I hope you all are ready with your answers. Yes, so ham taken your name, beta. Here you have the very first question. Yes, Jia. Who are we in the extract? I hope you all guy you all have read the extract. So quickly tell me who is referred to as we? The narrator and his friends, the narrator and his family, neighbors or servants. Very easy question. Yes, cooking corner, God of Thakur. Most of you are answering in the chat. Come on, guys, give your answers here in the menti quiz. Hi, Lisa, Jia, Aryan. Okay, yes, guys, superb. Very, very good. Good job. and here we have the first leaderboard superb guys very very well done so yes we have ted as the fastest congratulations metal artman zlatan kolbi sbk bill skates beyond dr sentry peed and ribbit amazing guys superb mind blowing yes so now we will have the second question Are we ready for the second question, guys? And I want your responses, correct ones, in the second question too. So you have the second question on your screens. Let's see what's the second question asking. Where? Why were the children pushed aside to have fun so that the bangles can be delivered to punish them so that the breads can be delivered to the servant? Come on, guys. Jia Soham. Ananya, everyone, come on, Aryan. 
my cooking corner okay most of you are correct guys good job so that the bread can be delivered to the servants so if you remember the baker used to come twice okay on his trips the first trip would be when he would be on his selling round and at that point of time he would greet the lady of the house and at the same time you know the children would be enthusiastic to see him and they would gather around him and the bakers and the baker would push the children aside with a mild rebuke so that he could deliver the bread to the servant theek hai yes everyone is this clear to all how many quizzes there is another menti quiz quest uh, there is another menti session okay after this we will have the yari show after this we will have some subjective question and then followed by that we will have another menti okay so we will have two mentees in total we will have two menti winners so let's give it up for that guys okay so we have at the very first position soham loves you sweetie ma'am thank you so much soham love you too beta then we have sim fastest congratulations sim tanishka aman hi ma'am your favorite cricketer i am not a cricket fan at all beta <laughs> sorry if i disappointed you by that comment uh, but that's that's what uh, is true for me i do not follow cricket okay but anyways clippy anvi love you ma'am thank you thank you anvi love you too beta then we have akshar aarti telugu boy okay and then we have varuni congratulations everyone good job hi jia rani soham yes beta mai you have to just go to menti.com and use the code 33216139 okay that's how you get into the menti hi shrina good afternoon beta okay chalo third question yes sujal ekta how are you which word or phrase in the extract means the same as an expression of disapproval or a scolding important question guys vocabulary this question is based on your vocabulary skills and i want every one of you to please 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 enhance your vocabulary we every day try to do a bit of vocabulary in our sessions so please follow the sessions closely so that you enhance your vocabulary rebuke is absolutely the correct answer rebuke is scolding or mild dis, uh, uh, dis, uh, an expression of mild disapproval okay or an expression of disapproval theek hai so please make a note of the word meanings in case you did not know but most of you already know but still okay this is a new word for you please note it down guys and here you go with the next leaderboard let's see let's see let's see okay let's see if there is any change very consistent okay so hum is again at the top consistently Sib, Tanishka, Aman, Akshat, Chaudhary, fastest, very good. Anvi, Varun, Clippy, BTS, and call me SBK. BTS Army is also there. Okay, I am so happy to see new students in the leaderboard. Congratulations to all of you. Hi, Rani, I am fine, dear. Thank you. Yes, Vita Jia. Fourth question and the final question from this particular menti. Are we ready? Are we ready? after this we will have the subjective questions and i want your participation same way as you are participating in this menti theek hai brave insider and what about the likes come on guys not even 40 what are you guys doing ha what are you guys doing chalo beta first you have to please hit the like button okay hit the like button guys I am not ready, Jia, because only thirty-eight likes. Come on, only thirty-eight likes. You are revising the full chapter, guys. Three parts, glimpses of India. In just one session, we are having a one-shot revision along with so many questions, both subjective and objective. Come on, guys. Likes to banta hai. Thoda support to banta hai. What do you think? Forty-three likes, really? In my phone, why is it not showing? Ha, now it's forty-two. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you, dear. Thank you so much. Fourth question, guys, and the last from this twenty. What was there in the basket? 
हाई श्रीनाथ फोर्टी फोर ओ थैंक यू थैंक यू डियर हाई आकृति फोर्टी थर्ड ओके थैंक यू आकृति कम ऑन गाइज लेट मी नो दी आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन हरी आप हाई आर्यन कम ऑन गाइज यस नाहर अरे नाहर यू आर फ्रॉम आर रेग्युलर बैच फ्रॉम माई बैच आई नो ऑफकोर्स हाउ कैन आई फोगेट यू How are you? Hi, Ritika. Yes, lobes and bangles. Lobes were for who? Who enjoyed the lobes and who enjoyed the bangles? Tell me. Yes, Jia, Ritika, Rani. Oh, thank you so much, Natraj. So ham loves you, sweetie, ma'am. Oh, thank you, thank you so ham, and you are the winner. Congratulations, congratulations to all the participants. and those of you who have come to the leaderboard very very well done guys sip tanishka uh, uh 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 and aryan ani ani okay akshat uh, some of your names are not visible sbk arti clip telugu boy good job good job good job very good Lobes are for adults and bangles are for children. Yes, brave insider. Good job. Okay, so now we will have the next. Yes. We will have the subjective questions, guys. Are we ready to have the subjective questions? Will you be giving the answers? this is how you are going to practice your question and answers because that is exactly how you will be asked in your exam so are we ready guys you enjoyed bread wah wow, ji wah wow. okay pink wall texture background acha last year yes but uh, this year we will have the vedantu background <laughs> Okay, thank you. Anyways, uh, so hum yes got a bread. Okay, chalo. So guys, uh, those of you who do not know me, those of you who joined for the first time and who are here for the uh, session for the very first time, let me give you a brief introduction about myself. I am your English master teacher Shweta Roy and I have pursued my masters in English and B.Ed. I have more than a year of teaching experience and have qualified C.Tet and mentored more than twenty thousand students, both online and offline. And you all know that my motto is to unleash the power within you all. So, guys, do you feel empowered? Yes, BTS Army. Do you all feel empowered? Loved by a lot of students. Oh, thank you so much, Soham. That's so sweet of you. Yes, Ayush and Anush. Hi, Anush. Okay, beta, brave insider. All right. So, homework locker. Songs home. Songs home has given us the homework answer for the previous session. Congratulations, Songsom! You are the homework rocker, and the session was on Madam rides the bus. And I want each one of you to please give your homework answers. I have seen a lot of students not attempting the homework answer, guys. It's very important. Why? Because you are going to practice. If you frame your own answer, that's exactly how you're going to practice, and that's exactly how you are going to come out with flying colors. Because that's the subjective question and as i told you that every day we practice our vocabulary every day we try a measure try something you know take measures to build our vocabulary and that is done by the word of the day today's word of the day is tranquil tranquil is peaceful and free from disturbance which is an adjective guys and this uh, the antonym that is the opposite of tranquil is disturbed this is how we have used it in a sentence and guys i want everyone to give your word of the day in the comment section we will take your word in the next session and i want all of you to make a sentence with tranquil right now in the chat yes beta ji yeah absolutely empowerment and empowerment to all of you han ji beta the art box we will do for ninth also 
यस अनन्या ओके एकता प्लीज गिव मी योर वर्ड इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन सो दैट इट डज नॉट गेट लॉस्ट इन द चैट very good cooking corner good job life in tranquil is sweet okay wow wow jia so you must have heard uh, you must have read that poem poem by william wordsworth lake isle of innisfree i'm sure this word is there <coughs> in that poem if you have read okay so great life in tranquil yes okay amanda yes yes in amanda also you have this word see so your word power is increasing yes or no so this exercise is helpful isn't it okay now we have a riddle an interesting riddle for all of you and we will answer this riddle at the end of the session we'll see the answer at the end of the session the riddle says how do you spell candy in two words okay think about it guys how do you sorry two letters how do you spell candy just in two letters okay all right jia ananya the sparky miss okay think about the answer guys and we will begin the session now we will look at the answer at the end of the session but before that guys i have an interesting quote for all of you look at this quote given by mark twain very very important see what does he say india is the one land that all men desire to see and having seen once by even a glimpse would not give that glimpse for all the shows of all the rest of the globe combined think about the quote take a while think about the quote what is it trying to say india is one land that all men desire to see and having seen once even a glimpse okay would not give that glimpse for all the shows for all the rest of the world combined isn't that beautiful and aren't you proud of being an indian yes or no yes or no guys okay i think all of you are giving the answer to the riddle yes all of you are correct we will discuss the riddle at the end <laughs> yes or no guys do you agree with this quote isn't that very very uh applicable so very applicable in the chapter glimpses of india so even if we take a glimpse of uh parts of india don't we have uh you know uh, we have such an enriched experience which is beyond which is much more than the experience that we would have uh, or the shows of all the rest of the globe even if we combined together isn't it guys yes one more menti is there gorav absolutely yes so you can utilize these quotes in your value based questions that is why we i begin my session with a quote because you know you can definitely utilize these or you know you can it's not important that you quote directly you can summarize this in your own word and you can use them in the value based question isn't that going to be helpful for all of you so that is why i tell you please pay attention to the subjective questions too because don't run away from the class the moment you see the objective questions that is what is going to help you out because term 1 uh, term 2 is completely subjective minded guys okay so we will have short answers value based questions menti again yes we do have another round of menti we will have another round of menti and followed by the homework question theek hai yes aryan yes got up so is baat pe likes guys not even 50 come on chalo guys what are you doing are you not excited let me see your love in in the form of likes not even half century kya kar rahe ho yaar come on thank you ansh uh, anush thank you anush thank you ananya thank you so much <laughs> love you too okay done 50 to 50 pe ruk jaoge kya done to make it century guys that's the target the rich culture and diversity of india absolutely so guys let's go and hit the like button share this video amongst your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel in case you haven't come on guys jaldi se karo subscribe target is 100 likes yes ananya thank you so much are siddharth okay the yari show is none other than our siddharth okay 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 so are you ready with the for the first short question guys This is your first short question. How do we get to know that the makers of bread still exist? Come on guys, you can do this. 
वी हैव स्टार्टेड कुकिंग कॉर्नर नाउ यू हैव टू स्टार्ट टाइपिंग चलो जिया पॉइंट शुड कम फ्रॉम योर एंड आई वॉन्ट फुल पार्टिसिपेशन इन द चैट फ्रॉम ऑल ऑफ यू कम ऑन प्लीज ब्रेन स्टॉम एंड गिव मी सम पॉइंट फॉर दिस क्वेश्चन ओ थैंक यू सो हम थैंक यू सो मच मीन्स अ लॉट ओके सो द नरेटर स्टेट्स दैट the eaters of loaves might have vanished loaves as in loaves of bread but the makers are still there and he further says that those age old time tested furnaces still exist and the fire in the furnaces has not been extinguished so these suggest that the makers of bread still exist okay yes study with rb good very good soham age old furnace yes ekta Next question why was the baker's furnace essential in a traditional goan village why was the so this is basically talking about the importance of baker's furnace baker's furnace is baker's hearth okay what do you think these are all direct questions from your text come on guys cooking corner yes absolutely correct yes anush so different kinds of breads are important during different occasions bolinhas had to be prepared during christmas and other festivals the mothers used to prepare sandwiches on the occasion of their daughters engagement so definitely the baker's furnace was essential and this justifies the importance of the uh, baker's furnace and the importance of the baker in totality okay main tradition yes so it was incomplete ekta yes absolutely correct without breads without the baker's furnace festivals were meaningless okay and events were incomplete yes radhika yes ji absolutely yes lisa very good cooking corner thank you so much for your inputs guys keep posting your messages i am reading them all yes ji i have read your answer beta i have already read it thank you describe kurg's weather now this is from the next part that is part 2 kurg okay kurg's weather and when is it most pleasant for the tourists to visit kurg come on come on you are doing an amazing job please keep up the good work 27th ko bhi test diya hai madhvi okay i hope that was good September till March. Okay, Ekta Ji, Ya Soham, Cooking Corner. ठीक है. Very good, Madhvi. Very good, Soham. Study with RB. Yes. The weather of Kurg is pleasant during the months from September to March. During that time, the weather is perfect with some showers thrown in for good measure. During the monsoon, it receives heavy rainfall. So this is the time when we should visit Kurg, not after March. So this is actually the perfect time. So if if you are planning to visit Kurg, please visit. Or one, two months are left. After that, you will have monsoon, which is not a good time for visiting Kurg. Yes, Ritika. Exactly, Jenny. Very good. Yes, the art box, Nippon. You have already visited. Wow. Please give us uh, give us some review. How did you enjoy? And which are the places that you visit visited, so that we can also follow. Okay, next question is from a Sam. Tea from a Sam. Okay, this is a tea country now. Explain with reference to a Sam. Important question. Hi, guy three. Beautiful. Oh, wow, Nippon. Which are the places that you visited? Tell us, please. Give us a give us a proper feedback so that we can also visit. Yes, Jenny, a Sam. Okay, you have to explain, beta. Hi Tanmay. Okay, okay. Ha Radhika. All right. So Assam has the world's largest concentration of tea plantation in the world. A large number of tea gardens can be found there and most of the tea grown in Assam is supplied all over the world. That is how Assam is a tea country. Is this clear? Very good Radhika. Very good. Absolutely correct. Hi Pari, good input from Radhika. Very good. Next is why did Pranjal's father say that Rajvi had done his homework before visiting Assam? What do you think, guys? We had done this. Come on. 
यस जिया सुजल ओके जैनी यस कुकिंग कॉर्नर थैंक यू अनुष ऑल राइट एनी एनी इनपुट फॉर दिस आंसर फ्रॉम यूल राधिका ओके राजीव वॉज वेरी क्यूरियस टू नो द डिफरेंट थिंग्स यस एकता एब्सोल्युटली Yes, study with RB. Good job, Rajveer was very enthusiastic. He was very excited about visiting Tea Garden, and he had done a lot of research. He had studied a lot before visiting the Tea Garden, and thus Pranjal said that the uh, that Rajveer had already done his homework. You can also mention the fact that you know he talked about the time period when uh, it would be the best sprouting season for you know uh, for for those tea plants. right so he also mention about the fact that he knew about the uh, second flush or the sprouting season so mention this point also here okay so he had the knowledge of the second flush or the sprouting season and this is what uh, this this was something that made rajveer remark that he had already done his homework okay that was the sprouting season beta ekta theek hai Yes, Pari. Very good. Yes, Radhika. Okay, so before we move ahead with the next long questions, I hope you guys are already aware about the Vedantu Ed Fest going on, and you have a fifty percent discount using the coupon code S W R E Pro. So now, if you use the coupon code S W R E Pro, the link is right there in the description box. And today is the last day. to avail this offer guys last day okay so you would get revision course all india mock test papers thousands of micro courses and full syllabus of cbse term 2 okay last day hai guys please uh, avail the opportunity do not miss out the opportunity it is only for 4000 where you are saving 1400 extra Okay, today is the last day. I will show you the platform and I will show you how to get yourselves enrolled in a moment. Okay, so please stay tuned. Yes, yes, Nipun. Hi, Ajit. Ajit. Okay, so guys, I will be talking about all these plans. I will show you directly the link, and I will talk, be talking about that. So please make a note of the batch starting dates for grade ninth and grade tenth, and get yourselves enrolled at the earliest because today is the last day of the offer. ठीक है? Yes, G. I have read May to July. हाँ <laughs> जी. Okay. So let's have the value-based question. The very first question is: During our childhood in Goa, the baker used to be our friend, companion, and guide. What does this statement imply in relation to the character of the baker? Okay, so we had done. Uh, we did you guys watch that video which I made for you related to uh, the art of writing subjective answers? Did you guys go through the video? Because in that video we had practiced writing subjective answers. So with very very important and effective tips. ठीक है so please take a note of those tips and this is something which will help you that those tips are going to help you in constructing your answer properly structuring your answer okay oh okay okay uday great great to know that beta code i have not yet acha uh, coupon code it is swre P R O. Today is the last day, beta. Okay, uh, to avail the fifty percent discount. Okay, so this coupon code Ekta is going to give you a complete fifty percent discount. If you click on the link, I will just uh, I will show you how you uh, go to that link and how can you get yourselves enrolled. Okay, just give me a moment. Okay, so come on. Hi, Sushank, Sheikh. All right. So this statement tells us that the baker was a very respected person in the Goan society because he would guide the children about good behavior. 
how how would he guide the children i told you remember in the previous class whenever you are talking about whenever you are giving a statement you have to also provide evidence from the text justifying that statement so this is the evidence that you are providing okay how do you know how can you say that he would be guiding the children uh, about good behavior when he would mildly rebuke the children for peeping into his basket okay and then he used to give respect to the elders when he wished them good morning when he wished the lady of the house good morning he was very informal with the children and so the author considered him as a friend and companion okay he was not not a simple vendor interested in selling he was very close to the children and the children loved his company right the children was uh, were so happy to meet them that they went out to meet them to greet uh, to greet the baker even before they would brush their teeth right so the, all these definitely suggest that he was an important character in the goan society those days theek hai yes the baker holds an important place very good jenny hi hi ragini how are you okay next is question number 2 how do kul's location people and natural features add to the diversity of india what do you think so what do you think guys Hi Devi Das, how are you? Hi Madhvi. Ah uh, Madhvi, beta, it, if you type the art of, uh, I'm I'm telling you the topic. I don't I don't have access to the link right now. The topic is the art of writing subjective answers. Okay, it is in this channel. So if you just search in this channel, you will get it. Okay, the art of writing subjective answers. You will get it. Yes, Ekta, absolutely correct. Hi, Jia. Okay, Madhvi. Right. So, Kulg is beautifully located and described as a piece of heaven that have that must have drifted from the kingdom of God. It has rolling hillsides with pollution-free river and forests teeming with wildlife. Very important point that you need to mention in your answer. Here, nature exists in in its pristine glory. which adds to the diversity of india further it has coffee and spice plantation quite different from the rest of india the local people who are the local people called they are called kodavus okay they are a martial race of course they are well known for their hospitality all these features of kurd add to the diversity of our country okay is this clear yes sambal absolutely correct thank you devi das thank you so much Is this clear? Hi, Aditi. Peace-loving people, but they were great warriors. Yes, very good. Yes, you can also mention that finest soldiers. They provided the finest soldiers. Uh, they had a decorative regi. Uh, sorry, regiment. Absolutely correct. Famous for his rainforests and spices. Yes, Jia. Absolutely. Yes, brave insider. Next and the last question. I think this is the last question. uh for the subjective part rajvi seem to have a lot of information about t what does he tell what character trait about him is revealed is it essential for children okay thank you radhika please tell me please give your inputs for this question come on everyone Rajbir seemed to have a lot of information about T. What does he tell? So, what what information did he share? Okay, what character trait about him is revealed on the basis of this particular context that he gave a lot of information? He had a lot of enthusiasm. Okay, is is it essential for children? This is again a value based question, guys. He was very curious to know. Where, yes, absolutely, Ekta. eager student okay sambal gorun there is no lag please refresh from your end yes drishya kurg is the best place to visit in winter yes yes spring winter and spring not in the monsoon absolutely okay brave insider yes so rajveer had been invited to spend his vacations With the uh, with his classmate Pranjal, whose father was the manager of T 
tea estate in Assam. He was quite excited about the trip and gathered considerable uh, amount of information about where tea originated and how it became such a popular beverage. He informs that about 50 crore cups of tea are consumed daily and that the name tea itself had originated from Chinese. He narrates two popular legends about origin of tea. Do you remember the two legends, guys? This is also an important question that you can have. What are the two legends? What are the two legends? Come on, tell me quickly in the chat. Okay, Rajbir exhibits an important value trait that is the prerequisite to gain knowledge, curiosity and eagerness to know. Okay. Moreover, he is not a passive learner but a proactive in collecting prior information. He likes to do homework thoroughly. Unlike you guys. You don't submit your homework in the comment section. Look at Rajbir. He does all his homework. <laughs> so that is something that we all should learn from Rajbir. Yes or no? So in today's session, you will all be submitting your homework. Yes or no guys? Okay, everyone. Yes. Yes, Moksh, you are absolutely correct. Yes, Ritika, Indian and Chinese. Yes. Okay, he likes to do. Okay, this is something that is appreciable and children should develop the habit about finding out about, uh, about the place that they are going to visit. How many of you do this? Before you visit any place, before you take a tour to any place, how many of you actually have that curiosity, just like Rajveer, to, you know, uh, explore first and find out and do a bit of research about that place before actually practically going and visiting that place. Not me, not me. Huh? Is there anyone who does it? So guys, from this chapter, definitely we can inculcate this particular quality from Rajveer. Yes or no? Can we inculcate the quality? Okay, Madhvi says I do read. Very excited. Yes, Drishya. Even I am super excited whenever I have to go for a trip and I do a lot of research about that. At least the spots that is, uh, you know, that we have to visit. Right? Yes. Okay, Abhishek. Hi. Okay, you are from the Middle East. Wow. Which place with a brave insider? First Google, okay Radhika. Chalo. So finally, can you have the can we have the answer to the riddle? I think most of us have already given the answer. Acha, you are from Qatar. Wow, beautiful place. Yes, Beta Jia, I have read your answer. Thank you so much. Yes, Shikhar. Alright, so I think most of you have given uh given the correct answer C and Y. These are the two letters, right? So isn't it candy? Okay, I hope you enjoyed this riddle, guys. And now we have the homework answer before we move ahead with the quiz questions. After reading the story, a baker from Goa, do you think our traditions, heritage, values and practices are the roots that nourish us? Why or why not? This is again a value-based question, guys. Will you please put down your homework answers in the comment, at least in this session, everyone? This is something which we can learn from Rajveer, yes or no? Doing our homework. Okay, yes, Madhavi. Okay, nice, nice. Okay, chalo. So, guys, now we will move ahead. Uh, okay, I will quickly show you the link and take you to the platform to help you understand how can you get yourselves enrolled and then we'll move to the mentee session. So, guys, this is the coupon code and today is the last day that this coupon code is going to give you a complete 50% discount. I will show you how exactly can you get yourselves enrolled. So, you can see this link, guys. This is how the session is going on. So, dekh lo bata. Ye hai link. This is the link. You can see CBSC term to full course. I think some of you were asking me. So, yeah, just go to this link. Just visit this link and you can see, guys. Now, if you are using this coupon code as WRE Pro, you are getting a complete 50% discount. And if you take the trial for 15 days, you will just get it at 650. Okay, just at 650. And guys, if you take the classic plan, you will get a special feature of doubt solving. The full course after application of the coupon code as WRE Pro is going to give you a complete 50% discount. You can get the trial for 15 days only at 850. 
In this plan, you can ask any doubts before and after the session, right from 8 a.m. to 11 p.m. Isn't that super amazing, guys? I'll take you to the platform and show you the replay of one of our sessions. So you can see, guys, these are the quiz questions. In every session, we have quiz question plus, obviously, the subjective questions. And we practice the subjective questions, guys. And you can see uh, this is how the session goes on. Okay. So we can interact with the children. We can communicate with the children. So see, these are the subjective questions that we do. Right. And we can also have a personal touch with the children. Okay. So this is something which you will really, really enjoy. So this. This is the golden opportunity. Make the most of the EdFest, guys. Okay? And now we will start with... Oh, this was The mentee quiz. Can we start? The code is 91597692. Please also read the extract. Jia, beta. No, bye. We, have, we still have another mentee. Okay, Shikhar. Come on. <laughs> yes, yes. Tanmay. Yes, yes. Tanmay. Okay, so come on, guys. Quickly join the mentee. Quickly join the mentee. And only 66 likes already crossed. Wow, superb. Guys, can we today cross century till the mentee gets over? Yes. So, please read the extract because the questions will be from this particular extract. Can we please cross century today? Hi, Amna. Yes, ready. Please repeat. What to repeat? Code 91597692. Okay, Madhvi. Repeat at the code, beta. This was the para. Okay, questions were given by your class teacher. Okay, okay, great. Coincidence then? Okay, chalo. Hi, Janvi. Chalo. First question, guys, on your screens. Come on. We will have another winner for this mentee. Okay, I hope everyone is ready. Yes, Janvi. Okay, the very first question on your screen. 70 likes ho gaya hai, bachcha party. 30 more to go. What kind of stories are the cool people always ready to tell? Very simple question. Come on. Yes, Tanmay. Thank you. Hi, Jenny. Okay, most of you are answering in the chat. Please participate in the mentee. All right. Tales of Valor. Absolutely correct. Good job, guys. Very good job. Please remember the answer also. And we have some new students on the leaderboard. We have Watson. Okay, congratulations, Watson, being the fastest and also the first. Yash. Hi, Yash. Jahanvi, Vasundara, Venture, Nicholas, Brave Insider, Kathy, Bill, Swayam. Very, very well done. Good job, everyone. Next question on your screens. Second question, guys. Hi, Srinath. Acha, you are in grade 11th. Wow. Still, you are attending the session. That's so amazing. What is the special favor granted only to them? To them as in to the Kurgi people. Okay. Based on the extract, you have to answer. Only people in India who can play, uh, buy things without paying, permitted to roam without a mask and permitted to carry firearms. Come on. Also read options. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Sorry, sorry. Yes, G, I'll read the options. Sorry. Okay, great. So, yes, only people to uh, in India who are permitted to carry firearms without a license. That's the special favor granted. Okay. Good job, guys. Most of you have done it correctly. And we have our next leaderboard. Okay, so we have Watson, Yash, Vasundhara, Janvi, Telugu Boy, Rishika, Swayam, Jenny and Cake. Very, very well done. Superb. 
Awesome. Third question, guys, on your screens. Please stay focused. Find the way in the extract, which means the same as courage and bravery usually in war. Numerous, valor, hospitality or recount. Vocabulary based questions. Come on. I have read the options too, Jia. Jia, are you not participating in the mentee? Okay, okay, Radhika. Superb. Most of you have given the correct answer. So you are improving on your vocabulary also. I'm so happy to see that. Very good. Congratulations, everyone. So again, our leaderboard is very consistent. Watson again at the top, Yash again the fastest, Vasundra, Janvi, Rishika, Telugu boy, Swayam, Jenny and Cake. And now the final question, who do you think would come out the winner for this particular mentee? Any guesses guys? What are the natives called? Sorry, there is a spelling mistake here. It's called, okay, C-A-L-L-E-D. There's a typing error here. Masai, Kurgi, Kodavus, Paders. Come on, guys. Come on, everyone. Really? Thank you so much, Jia. Okay, actually, both hona chahiye. I will just correct this. Kurgi and Kodavus, both are correct. Theek hai? So, I am just correcting this. Options mein. Okay. Kurgis are also called Kodavu. So both are correct actually. Paders are Goan, right? So yes, guys, superb. Superb, superb, superb. Yes, Janvi, let me see who comes out as the winner. Yash, okay, Yash is the winner, surprisingly. Sanskar, uh, then we have Vasundara and others, Jenny, Brave Insider and great job, great job. Yes, Jia, Janvi, Srinath. Okay, superb guys. I hope you enjoyed the session today. And we will come up with more super interesting sessions only and only for you guys. Okay? Thank you so much everyone. Please stay tuned and please enjoy the Ed Fest. Today is the last date guys. So make the most of it. And don't forget to hit the like button. Share the video. Comment on the homework question. Everyone should comment on the homework question. And please, please, please do subscribe to the channel in case you have missed it. Okay? Bye, everyone. Congratulations, everyone. Asha. Okay. Bye-bye.